Hey guys, I'm just playing around here, but I wanted to show you something kind of neat. This was found quite some time ago, but I haven't seen really any videos that go into, oh, I don't know, the uh, the close-up of this. So interestingly, there are these, on Google Earth, you can find these obelisks that are located out in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. Some people have pointed to, including ancient origins or something, that this is opposite of the pyramids on the other side of the Earth. So if we were to come over here this is where the pyramids are and on the other side of the earth we have this right here so if you put your terrain on and you use Google Earth you can't just plug this into a map thing uh, it's right up here at 32 degrees uh, 30 minutes 7 seconds south 149 degrees uh, 52 minutes uh, 46 seconds west okay so if you come down here and you have your terrain on and you zoom into this area right here and you can use these uh, they're called ship lines is where the ships have actually gone over and apparently have looked at the earth's uh, ocean depth in more detail than we would normally get uh, God knows what detail that they're not putting in these things but anyway just so that you know this is a good way to line up on the thing because you can see these crisscrosses happening. So if you come down here and you look at this thing, it's really interesting because and I think even Klaus Dona goes into his lectures of this. One of these is apparently uh, 4,000 meters high, okay? And another one is like 1,000 meters high or something a little bit more than that. But here's the neat thing about this thing. If you zoom in on this, okay, you'll notice that there is this hole. And this hole goes down r really far. And I don't know, uh, they must have used some kind of a radar system or a sonic uh, radar system that went down this far. But here's the neat thing about it. It's not just that it appears that way. But also, if you run your mouse over it, and I'll look, if you'll look at my elevation right here, it's about 17,000 feet, okay? Now, when I run over the middle of this thing, it goes all the way up to about 40,000 feet down. Now, that is what? If we have 5,282 feet in a mile, is 8 miles versus 16. So you can see that this goes down a long ways. And uh, anyways, uh, if you take a look at it from the side, you can also see it. Now, there was a video a guy put out where he ran his, uh, some kind of a ruler over this thing. And I guess he showed the depth, but I'm kind of showing you a different way. And if I zoom in on this a little bit more, it's kind of hard to get in there. You can kind of see a little bit down this hole. Of course, this is an exact reconstruction of it because we're looking at kind of a radar thing going on here. Uh, but you can see it goes really far down. And there's no telling. That says almost 40,000 feet. That is a long ways down, folks. I thought you'd be interested in seeing that. Uh, so you guys take care, and I'll talk to you soon.